Good morning, happy weekend. Um, today is the day that I'm going to convert this extra spare bedroom into a mock uh, or trial Sunkiss Lynn, the business that I started uh, a couple years ago. I am hoping to have a shop front at some point. Um, but it's just, uh, it's been kind of on the back burner. It's been a back burner project. So um, we're going to play with it a little bit today. Um, it's not going to be functioning here in this space because um, that's not allowed. <laughs> um, but it's just going to be for fun and to kind of play with it and test it out and stay motivated. So without further ado, I will show you the room that's to be converted and then we'll get started. walk in we got the displays this is way too crowded um a little piecemeal at the at the moment but um got here we probably want some shelves right there um and i wasn't anticipating using these tables um so it was it'll be probably more junk jewelry themed um which but this is just a, a mock setup. So some of the merchandise there. Um, it's not actually about selling merchandise. It's about building a life you want. So um, just a place to sit if you need a moment. And if you go like this, there's a little mirror there. So if you want to try on one of the bags that they've got here, you can just check it out in the mirror right there. Um, this is actually representative of a workspace. <laughs> I don't have um, enough tables or desks uh, to kind of make that work, but... Um, and then these probably wouldn't be on the floor either, um, tripping hazards, uh, but I am not going to hang them on the wall. I didn't take the time to hang them on the wall yet, the, the little flowers. Um, so we'll probably stick them together and make a, a wall ornament out of them. But this is representative of the workspace. This is just a homemade t-shirt quilt um, with t-shirt pillows. And then this is representative of different supplies because we will have supplies for crafting here. Upcy it's all upcycled. The idea was upcycling. So... Um, so some of these are more upcycled than others. These are kind of fundamental implements for making jewelry. Um, some knitting things. We do have some, uh, some upcycled t-shirt yarn there. Uh, that's paper crafts. Uh, a little bit of glitter that I just had left over from Halloween years ago. So probably 2015. Um, some sewing stuff and then some painting stuff and some pockets for making the wallets. Um, but we have another uh, kind of chair there um, leading to the restroom so if you want to kind of wait while someone needs to go to the bathroom right like that or that could also be a um a place to try things on depending on you know the boutique style this is actually uh this is the desk um so um this is where you would ask for the coffee or snackies um 
and um, we will have little merchandise here too, um, pens, notebooks, measuring tapes um, for completing your upcycle crafts if you want to do them here. And um, there would probably be a few more tables, like I said, here, because um, not everyone likes working on the floor. I actually do like working on the floor, um, but I don't know how bohemian we want to go with a with a commercial establishment. Um, <laughs> um, but uh, that being said, uh, this will be the, where you check out. Um, got business cards. We've got, oh gosh, I wonder if they, okay, yeah, they don't have my old address on them. That is good. Um, you shall build the life you want. So those are business cards. Um, but we'll have little little things here and there. I did design some, um, and they can be ordered at any time. Um, that is a, actually a, a sun lamp, but that could also be representative of a like a square or you know a little tablet to check out. So not a big deal. Um, a little cash register here. Got some extra mugs for the tea. Um, yeah, and this is um, some some merch that needs a little bit of fixing up. Um, it kind of got jostled in the move. Uh, otherwise, just organizational things um, uh, that would probably be on a shelf if I had more shelves. I'm not going to hang shelves in this apartment probably because um, that would be a, quite a bit of work in, uh, for just a year. So, And then these are other projects to work on. So um, when there's no people here, you can just pop a squat wherever and do a little sewing or what have you. So, yay. So that is um, a potential for a Sunkist Land. Very cool. Um, if we do go a truck route, um, this might be a completely different. Um, I don't know. I haven't done any pricing out of those things yet or um, how far down the line that would be, frankly. Um, but it is about building the life that you want and um, upcycling what you have to um, be more sustainable in the resources that you use. So it's, like I said, this is pretty piecemeal. It's pretty helter-skelter at present, but it's pretty stinking cool to be able to map it out and kind of see where we're at. Yay. So thank you for coming along on this journey today and we will see you next time. And you can check us out on Etsy. Um, we do have a few items on Etsy at present um, over on our display wall over here. <laughs> We're getting fancy. But we got just some centerpieces and the scarves. Um, I tend to throw in as a freebie. Um, some little slippers, some upcycle bags. These are actually hand-stitched. Um, some pockets. I love the pockets and the little, little flowers as well. So just... Kind of fun. We got some rugs on the ground. That it probably wouldn't be on the ground here either. Some more centerpieces on the ground, but woohoo!